Good evening all and welcome to another video on All Healthy Ale. Tonight we are going back to Northern Monk. It's been a while since I've had a Northern Monk beer and it's been far too long. And the beer in question is uh, from the Patrons Project and it is this one. Um, I can't find the name and I'm sure I'll find it online in a bit but it is 907 uh, otherwise known as something else but it's a lot of old comedians dressed up as WWE wrestlers. By the looks of things, uh, you've got Brian Blessed as the Ultimate Warrior. You've got Ken Dodd as Brett the Hitman Hart. You've got what looks like... Oh, what's his face? Harry Enfield as... Oh, I think it was Brutus the Barber Beefcake. And you've got the Chuckle Brothers as the Legion of Doom, uh, which is awesome. And someone as The Undertaker. I recognise the face, but I can't think who it is. Anywho, what is it? Well, it is a double dry hopped milk sugar IPA and it weighs in at 7.4% and it tells me that it's hopped with Amarillo, Citra, Laurel and Columbus. Uh, I paid £6.25 for this from Otter's Tears. And, as always with the uh, the Patrons Project stuff, you get a peely label, which if you peel it, it reveals lots of information about the, uh, the collaborators on said beer. And... Uh, Oh, that's sorry, it's Northern Heroes, Northern Rumble. Um, I can't believe I missed that. It's written in the bloody front of the can. So, uh, yeah, it says they're no stranger to a multi-hopped IPA or lactose-infused, luxuriant tropical milkshake, but a straight-up double-dry hopped milk sugar IPA, something until now I hadn't tried at their mash paddles. Um, yeah, so there's not, not an awful lot of extra information about the beer in there. Uh, the ABV, like I say, 7.4. The IBU's 12, so it's not going to be very bitter at all. Um... So, awesome artwork on the can, as always on the Patrons Project stuff. Um, really, really inspirational artwork. I love it. They make it interesting. So let's crack her open and see what we think. So, of course, I'm going to pour into the Northern Monk schooner. And uh, the beer is pale. A little paler than I was expecting. Not overly hazy either. I was expecting a little bit of haze. We've got a humongous head from my terrible paw. But that should be it. It's pretty clear. Um, which for a milkshake IPA, I'm quite surprised at. Um, yeah, quite surprised. I was expecting a milk sugar IPA, not a milkshake IPA. Either way, it's pretty pale, pretty clear, lightly carbonated, and we've got a couple of fingers of white head that's a little bit blamongy. It always bodes well. Let's have a whiff. Sweet. It is sweet. There is no two ways about it. The citrus hops, you've got that kind of kind of condensed milk element of sweetness. Otherwise, it's pretty light on the aroma. Um, let's top her off. See, now I've given the can a bit of a, a bit of a whiz. Have we got anything extra to add? Not really, no. That is surprising. I'm, I'm used to murk from uh, from the monk. Anyway, let's have a taste. It smells good. Let's see what it's like. That's interesting. That's really interesting. That is everything I expect flavour-wise from the monk. You've got the obvious inclusion of the lactose. It's got that creaminess. You've got the sweetness of the hops. There is a, there is a bit of bitterness, but it fades really quickly. It, it supports the rest of the flavour profile. But man oh man, that does not drink like a 7.4% it does. It's got a decent body to it. It's probably medium on the body. It's a little bit of pine resin going on. But mostly quality, quality citrus flavours um, backed up by that creaminess. Think those lemon puff biscuits, that level of cream but amplify the citrus flavours an awful lot. It's 
really nice. Mm. Oh, I could. I could sit and drink loads of this. I really could. The finish is quite long. Let's say it's a almost like an orangey, like a sweet orange on the finish. It's really nice. Mm. So, Northern Monk, Northern Heroes, Northern Rumble, Patrons Project 907. Can't really show you the front of the can. Where is the front? Um, let's show you a gratuitous shot of the uh, the Chuckle Brothers' uh, animal and hawk. There you are. Isn't that funny? It's amazing. And that's Brian Blessed. Look, funny as hell. And uh, I think it's Les Dawson as the Undertaker. I think. In there. Maybe. I don't know. Either way, great can, great beer. Would I buy this again? There hasn't been another monk beer that I wouldn't buy again. Would I rush out and buy it again? Do you know what? I really would. Um, because it's great. It's got plenty of hop. But they're subtle hops. You've got plenty of flavour. You've got the sweet orange over a, the subtle bitterness up front. And you've got some really nice sort of generic. And, and that sounds wrong, but it's not. It's a generic sort of citrus flavour. So you've got a bit of everything going on. A bit of lemon. A little bit of grapefruit. Not a lot of grapefruit, mind. Um, but mostly a lot of sweet lemons there. I can't remember the name. There's a particular type of lemon that is really, really sweet. Um, I can taste that here. Oh, let's get the last of that in the can. Or right out of the can, even. I might say sweet orange on the finish. So, yeah, I would rush out and buy this again. I really would. I really would. Now, could it be improved for my liking? Potentially a little bit. You could add a little bit more bitterness, but then again, that would potentially detract from what makes this really nice, and that is those kind of sweet citrus flavours. So maybe not. Maybe I wouldn't want to change it. Um, so as for a score, I'm going to give the old uh, the Northern Heroes Northern Rumble Patriots Project 907 a solid four and a half out of five on the untapped score so there we are another killer beer from northern monk um if you've never tried one why not um i thoroughly recommend them and i've not had a bad beer from them at all so i'm gonna leave it there so i have a tendency to waffle and i'm running out of time on the old camera so ladies and gents boys and girls this has been an amazing beer i've been nick and i will see you again soon for another video bye